In recent times, Google Drive has become one of the most popular platforms to save important files. But what if you accidentally delete an important file on Google Drive? Should you lose hope in accessing it ever? Or is there a way to restore permanently deleted files on Google Drive? In this video, we will see how to recover those deleted files from Google Drive by exploring different Google Drive restore methods. But before going any further into these Google Drive recovery methods, please kindly like this video and subscribe to our channel to get more informative content just like this. Now, let's get into the video. There are several methods you can use to recover those deleted Google Sheets or files. Method number one, recover data from Google Drive with Trash Restore. The first and simplest method to recover those deleted files from Google Drive is to recover them from the Trash folder in Google Drive. For this Google Drive Restore method, open Google Drive on your computer and then click on the Bin tab on the left side of your screen. Now, right-click the file you want to recover and click on Restore. Your file will move from the Google Drive Trash folder to its original location in the drive. Method number two, recover Google Drive files using the admin console. Another method to recover those deleted files from Google Drive is actually by recovering them using the admin console. But for this method, you will need to be a G Suite user. You will first have to log in to the Google Admin Console and then select the user you want to recover the deleted files for. Now, click on the three dots on the right of the screen and select Restore Data from the pop-up menu. Next, select Drive as the application on Google Drive to recover the deleted files and click the Restore button. This is how you can recover lost data from Google Drive using Google Admin Console. Method number three, recover files from a deleted account by transferring ownership. If you manage a Google Workspace for an organization and want to know how to recover some deleted Google Sheet docs, then one of these recovery methods involves changing ownership of the account. First, go to Directory, then Users, then More Options in the Google Admin Console. Now click on the Recently Deleted Users from the drop-down menu. After assigning the user to the relevant organizational unit, go to the Apps section in the menu. From Apps, select Google Workspace, and in the Google Workspace menu, click on the Drives and Docs button. The last step to restore permanently deleted files on Google Drive is to transfer ownership from the Drives and Docs menu. This will complete your Google Drive restore procedure. Method number four, recover deleted Google Drives with Manage versions. Sometimes you only lose data on a Google Drive file and not the whole file. This is especially common in the case of Google Docs. To restore permanently deleted files on Google Drive using this method, first open Google Drive on your computer and then right-click on the file you want to restore a previous version of and select Manage Versions from the pop-up menu. The new pop-up will show all the available versions of the file. Click on the three dots against the relevant version and select Download from the drop-down menu. This is how to recover lost data from Google Drive by managing versions. All these Google Drive data loss recovery methods are great, but they might not always work. So thankfully, there is a way that you can recover permanently deleted Google Drive files that works 10 out of 10 times and reverses your Google Drive data loss. Recovered by Wondershare lets you recover all those deleted Google Sheets and other files with just a few clicks. So here's how you can do it. First, download the recovered software from the Wondershare website. After downloading the setup file, run it to install on your computer. When the software is installed, open it by clicking the Start Now button and once launched, select the location to restore permanently deleted files on Google Drive. Now wait for the recovered software to scan the location and you can filter the results by file status, time, size, tag and type as well. Now select the file you want to recover and click on the Recover button in the bottom right. You also can preview the files before recovering them to make sure they're the right ones. This is how you can recover deleted files from Google Drive using Recover It by Wondershare. Up until now, we have seen different methods to restore deleted files from Google Drive, but we still haven't talked about some precautionary measures you can take to prevent something like this to happen in the first place. It's always better to have access to your files instead of trying to find methods to recover them. So here are some measures you can take to prevent data loss in Google Drive. It is 
always better to be safe than sorry. So make sure you regularly backup your data using the Google Backup and Sync features. You can backup any kind of file, including images and videos, to your Google Drive through this. Google Drive often becomes a target for hackers. So make sure you also regularly scan your Google Drive files for any viruses or malware. Sometimes people are in a hurry and end up deleting very important files on their Google Drive. So my recommendation is double check before deleting. This will avoid any inconvenience in the future from deleting those important files. You should only give edit access to your files to whom you really trust. And it's much better if you manage permissions in such a way that you are the only one who can see and edit your very important files. Otherwise, you might end up going through these Google Drive recovery methods. And no one wants that. People lose important data on their Google Drives every day and for several reasons. But thankfully, on this video, we went through a lot of recovery methods to get those files back to your Google Drive. The best one is still using a recovery by Wondershare that can get your file without any mistakes. And it works, again, 10 out of 10 times. It's crazy. We also went through some precautionary measures that you can take to prevent that data loss on Google Drive so you don't have to go through these recovery methods once again. Thank you so much for reaching the end of this video and I truly hope it was helpful in getting your files back to your Google Drive. Uh, also, please leave in the comments below your own experiences using these recovery methods and any questions you may have also about these methods. Please do not forget to leave a like and subscribe to our channel so we can continue giving you more videos just like this. I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.